Uh, from Stitch, is that? Yes. Uh, so a couple things quickly. Uh, uh, as much as it, this is wonderful and fun, I know it's also really stressful for a lot of people. There's a, a lot of folks who end up hiding in their rooms, <coughs> and unintentionally or not, and then feel awful about it. It would be wonderful if somebody from staff or, or you know somebody in charge <laughs> could at least take a shout to people that at some point in the cruise invariably people start to get a little introverted more so than a, a lot of us are already. It would be <laughs> it, it would be wonderful to hear from from you guys. Just it, just at least a nod. The, the folks who are taking some extra time to themselves don't worry about it. We all do it. <laughs> So something like, hey, all you introverts, please come forward. We want to help you. I'll just single you out. Introverts, stand up. Yeah. Uh, yeah, no, I hear you. Well, I can tell you, I can tell you that I personally am a uh, high-functioning introvert. I don't know. What's, what's the expression? What's the expression where everybody thinks you're an extrovert, but you're actually a secret introvert? Liar. Liar. What's well, a funny thing that happens here, and I'm, I'm the same way, and I've talked with a number of people for whom, in their regular context, they're, they're completely introverted, uh, and that over the years being here, it's like, it's like, uh, it's a horrible metaphor, but an infection. Like, at first, you just have a pimple, and that's, that's the first friend you need. And then, oh boy. suddenly, you have a rash, and then a table full of friends. But this metaphor just keeps on getting worse. But the point is, you can start with small things, and definitely, this, this, it can be intimidating, even with a group that's so welcoming, to put yourself out there, and uh, I think it's both ways, that if you see someone that maybe is looking a little uncomfortable, and you are feeling comfortable yourself, to reach out a little bit. And we are, we, we do try to put out the messaging consistently across the year, that we, you know, we understand that this can be a very overwhelming thing, there's a lot of choices, and it's a big boat with all these people on it all of a sudden, and we highly encourage everyone, in your own time, and in your own way, do what you can, that's also why we try to offer a lot of things at a lot of different scales. But I hear what you're saying, is that, is that also, I mean, this is, this is my thing too, is that when I, when I get to a point where I've had enough of people, and I'm not even talking about here, but just generally in my life, the older I get, the more I understand how it works in my brain. But when I start getting that feeling that I've learned to recognize, is like I have used too much energy being around people, I need to go into my cave for a little bit. Part of going into the cave is allowing yourself to go into the cave, and to say to yourself, it's fine that I'm going to skip dinner, <laughs> or whatever or whatever it is, I'm going to skip this thing to hang out my room, because the thing about a cruise ship is one of the greatest things you could do is sit in a chair by yourself and look at the ocean. That totally counts as a thing that you are doing. You're on vacation. Yeah. Yeah, no, I, I agree. And I, I, I agree, I, I, and I hear what you're saying, because the message is always like, oh, people who are, people who are shy and people who are introverts come to the parties. But the message is also, if you want to hang out in your room, hang out in your room. The rooms are pretty nice. You got a television. You can have a club sandwich delivered any time, day or night. <laughs> hang out the car, get coffee and, and breakfast in the morning. Spend the whole day there. I don't care. It's great. <laughs> yeah, I used, to, I used to think cruises were tacky before I started doing this full time. And the thing that sold me was uh, drinking a whole pot of coffee in my bed. Um, <laughs> And then wearing my pajamas to the dining room oh and scowling at everybody, oh and then going right back to my room to sleep and breathe. I mean, like it's yeah, it's amazing. Like that, I, I don't know. I think that is a valid Joko Cruise. All of, all of this being said, Joko Cruise 2021 is going to. We are all going to stay in our rooms at all times, and we're going to pass notes to each other by way of our room stewards. <laughs> Call the cards.